Mr. Lumada. He will be starting soon. Oh, story time with Mr. Lumada. Where all your dreams come true. Oh, he brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely. Won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be here. Story time with Mr. Lamada. He will be starting soon. Oh. Story time with Mr. Lamada. Where all your dreams come true. Oh. He brings to life. Your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely. Won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be here. Good morning, good morning, and welcome to Story Time. Thank you so much for joining me. Happy Thursday. Oh my goodness, the week is almost done. Yes, indeed. Thank you so much for joining us and uh, glad that we're here together for another reading. Thank you for spending time with us today. Thank you for taking the time to join us. We do have a special one, one that is full of laughter all the time. Charlie and Mouse are here with some magic. Yes, Charlie and, and, and Mouse are magic. This one by Laura Snyder and illustrations by Emily Hughes. And we're reading this one with permission of the publishers, Chronicle Books of San Francisco. Thank you so much for joining in, and I'm glad that you're here with me today. Yes, Charlie and Mouse are magic coming right up. Thank you so much for joining in today, and I hope that you are doing well. Please let us know where you're joining in from and who is joining in with you. Yes, lots of fun guaranteed today with Charlie and Mouse, and I hope that you do enjoy it. Thank you for being here with us. How's the weather where you are? I hope it is not, it is not treating you too bad. Thank you so much for being here with us indeed. Out here in Oakland, um, a little cold, but it's been dry for sure the last few days. And uh, I think we need the rain, but also it's good to have a good balance of, um, of, uh, of this. Thank you so much for joining in. And yes, glad that we're here together. Where are you joining us from today? Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Yes, remember too that uh, Marietta and uh, Jack the Library Cat are coming to Storytime on March 2nd. So keep an eye out for that one. Excited indeed to, to share with you all. And of course, to share them with you all here and uh, get to learn the process and where the magic, the inspiration and all the magic came from. We do have um, many other guests that will be coming to Storytime. Stay tuned, keep an eye out and those will be announced in due course. Thank you so much for joining in today. Let us see who is with us, ready to enjoy a wonderful story. Good morning to you. How are you doing today? Erin and Clara out in mild Massachusetts. Sounds like it's getting better. Thank you so much for joining in today. And of course, Erin, Clara, and Tara, thank you for joining us. Welcome to Storytime. I'm glad that you are here. Yes, indeed, out there in Massachusetts, where it is mild today. Thank you so much for being here with us. I appreciate you so much. Good morning to you. How are you doing, Sarah and Nathan? In very, very windy Illinois. Seems like staying right on brand there, Illinois. Thank you so much for joining in. And of course, you say happy Thursday to everybody that is joining in. Well, happy Thursday to you. Have a wonderful, wonderful Thursday. Thank you for being being here with us. Thank you for spending the time with us. Yes, just like Charlie and Mouse, you're all magic out there. And we cannot wait to see what this book has to offer today. If you follow this series, you know that this one will be book six. Yes, there's been six amazing adventures with um, Charlie and Mouse. And within those adventures, there's multiple stories. So it's been many, many, uh, many adventures of um, Charlie and Mouse. And I hope that you've enjoyed them. I hope that you enjoy this one. If it's the first time you're coming across them, we're happy to introduce them to you. And remember too, that you can always go back to stories and get to enjoy them. You can always go back and find Storytime at Storytime with Mr. Limada. 
www.facebook.com and also at Storytime with Mr. Limada on Facebook and YouTube. And why not follow us on Instagram and get to see everything Storytime. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. And of course, if you're looking to know what's happening, what, uh, what readings are coming up, Instagram is the best bet. And also we do um, share our Facebook events on the Facebook page so you get to see what's coming. Um, and if you're up for a surprise, join us in the morning and see what's on. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime. Glad we are here together. Get ready, get comfortable, get cozy as our story is about to start, but only after this short message and we'll be right back. Thank you for being here with us today on Storytime. Appreciations to you all. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Jack and I are coming to Storytime on March 2nd, and we can't wait. I'll be showing you book dummies, artwork, and of course, reading Jack the Library Cat. See you soon. Bye. Welcome back. Yes, you heard it. You know it. Jack the Library Cat and, of course, Marietta are coming to Storytime. March 2nd. So do keep an eye out for that one. Do keep an ear out for that one. Today, though, we do have another classic. This one, Charlie and Mouse are magic. Coming to us from Laura Snyder and illustrations by Emily Hughes and reading this one with permission of the publishers, Chronicle Books of San Francisco. Are you ready? All right, here we go. <laughs> Charlie and Mouse are magic. Ah. Oh. Any of those? Look at something you would want to try, want to get, want to play with. <laughs> oh, I love their collection. Is that a sushi roll? No. <laughs> See where my brain is. It's food. Food. <laughs> All right, here we go. Charlie and Mouse are magic. Written by Laura Snyder and illustrations by Emily Hughes. And we're reading this one with permission of the publishers, Chronicle Books of San Francisco. A big thank you to them indeed for allowing us to share such amazing books here on Storytime with you all. <laughs> thank you, Chronicle. All right, so there are four amazing stories in this one. And we're going to read the first two. We're going to read Magic. And of course, Invisible. I'm excited for those. I can't wait to share them with you, yes. So we are reading the first two stories in this book. Magic in Invisible. Here we go. <laughs> Chapter one, Magic. Oh, abracadabra, hocus pocus. <laughs> All right, mom was in the kitchen. Mouse was in the kitchen too. Mouse, said mom, you are making a mess. Mom, said mouse, you are making a mess. <laughs> mouse, you are making a mess. Mom, you are making a mess. <laughs> oh. I'm not just making a mess, said mom. I am making dinner. Well, said mouse, I'm not just making a mess either. I am making a potion. It is a magic potion. Oh. <laughs> I'm not just making a mess. I am making dinner, said mom. Well, said mouse, I am not just making a, a mess either. I am making a potion. It is a magic potion. Ooh. <laughs> oh, said mom. I did not see that you were making a magic potion. I know, said mouse. When will you be done? asked mom. I need to finish dinner. Soon, said mouse. Soon I will be done. <laughs> Oh, my. Mouse added a pinch of salt. Mom waited. Mouse added two squirts of dish soap. Mom waited. Ah, love your patience, Mom. <laughs> Mouse stirred the magic potion. Mom waited still. <laughs> he stirred it slowly. Mom waited. 
<laughs> Soon I will be done, Mao said. Mom waited. <laughs> oh. Now, said Mas, I will put a drop of potion on my nose and make a wish. <gasps> Want to make a wish too? <laughs> Mas put a drop of potion on his nose. Mas waited. Mom waited. Mas waited some more. <laughs> Mouse, said mom, I would really like to finish dinner. Do you think if I gave you a cookie, you could wait in the other room? <laughs> mom, shouted Mouse, wow, I can't believe it. What, what, what? What, said mom, what can, what can't you believe? <laughs> Can't you believe indeed? <laughs> a cookie is exactly what I was wishing for. Isn't that amazing? My potion works. <laughs> amazing, said mom. Now, scram. <laughs> amazing, mom said. Now, scram. <laughs> Hey, said Charlie, how did you get a cookie? Oh, magic, said Mouse. <laughs> magic, asked Charlie. Scram, said Mom. <laughs> Go <laughs> out of the kitchen. <laughs> Charlie and Mouse scrammed. <laughs> how did you get a cookie? Magic. Do you believe his magic work? Well, here's more tricks for you. This part, chapter two, is called Invisible. Mom is in a mood, said Mouse. I wonder why. <laughs> I am in a mood too, said Charlie, because I am covered in glop. That is not glop, said Mouse. That is my potion. <laughs> Mom is in a mood, said Mouse. I wonder why. Oh, we wonder why too, Mouse. <laughs> I'm in a mood too, said Charlie, because I am covered in glop. That is not glop, said Mouse. That is my potion. Oh. <laughs> What will your potion do to me? Say, asked Charlie. That remains to be seen, said Mouse. Oh, yeah. Also, it is not fair that you got a cookie, said Charlie. You can have half of my cookie, said Mouse. <laughs> it is not a very big half, said Charlie. <laughs> but thank you. <laughs> yes, you can have... Half of my cookie, said Charlie, said Mouse. It is not a very big half, said Charlie, <laughs> but thank you. <laughs> yes, indeed. Do you know anybody that shares like that, that gets the bigger half? <laughs> yes, indeed. Charlie and Mouse munched their cookies. After a while, Tess and Lottie walked past. Charlie and Mouse waved. Tess and Lottie did not wave back. Mr. Eric and Mr. Michael jogged past. Charlie and Mouse waved. Mr. Eric and Mr. Michael did not look. What's happening here? <laughs> What's happening? Yes. Tess and Lottie walked past without waving, did not wave back. Mr. Eric and Mr. Michael jogged right past. Charlie and Mouse waved. Mr. Eric and Mr. Michael did not look. Hmm, what do you think is happening? 
<laughs> Mouse, said Charlie, I think maybe we are invisible. Whoa, yes, said Mouse, nodding. We are probably invisible. Interesting, said Charlie. You know, said Mouse, when you're invisible, you can make silly faces at people and they will not even notice. <laughs> yes, you know, when you're invisible, you can make silly faces at people and they will not even notice. Let's try it, said Charlie. Let's try it. A car drove past the house. A car drove back past the house. Charlie and Mouse made silly faces. The car did not stop. <laughs> oh. It's good to be invisible, isn't it? <laughs> A car drove, by, drove past. Charlie and Mouse made silly faces. The car did not stop. <laughs> when you're invisible, said Charlie, you can shout nonsense and nobody will say a word. Mm, is that so? Good idea, said Mouse. Let's go. <laughs> Charlie shouted. Squaza! Wop wop! Baka bop! <laughs> Mouse shouted. Snuckity wackity! Blap! Nobody said a word. <laughs> Do you have some silly words that you want to shout? Do you think anybody will hear them? Are you invisible too? <laughs> Skawaza! Wap wap! Bada bap! Nobody said anything. Snackity wackity! Blap! Still, nobody said anything. <laughs> It began to rain. When you're invisible, said Charlie, you can take off all your clothes and dance and dance in the rain. Oh, let's do it, said Mouse. Charlie and Mouse took off their clothes. They danced and danced and danced in the rain. It was muddy and fun. <laughs> oh, and good thing nobody can see them. They're invisible. <laughs> yes. Charlie and Mouse took off their clothes. They danced and danced in the rain. It was muddy and fun. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, it does look like fun. Then Miss Margaret ran past with an umbrella. Hi, Charlie, <laughs> she shouted. Miss Margaret shouted. Hi, Mouse. It looks like you are having a fun time. Uh oh. <laughs> Maybe not as invisible as we thought. <laughs> and that is the end of our story for today. Thank you so much for joining in. I hope you enjoyed the adventures. Yes, Charlie and Mouse are magic. Always managed to make me laugh, these two. Laura Snyder and Emily Hughes wrote this one. And of course, we're reading it with permission of the publishers. Chronicle Books of San Francisco. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you get to try out some magic potions today. And I hope yours work a little better than Charlie's and Mouse's. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime. Catch me on the other side of this short break. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Jack and I are coming to Storytime on March 2nd, and we can't wait. I'll be showing you book dummies, artwork, and, of course, reading Jack the Library Cat. See you soon. Bye. Welcome back indeed. Thank you so much for being here with me on Storytime. I hope you enjoyed our lovely uh, book today. And this one is called Charlie and Mouse, A Magic, book six. Yes, this one is book six, written by Laura Snyder, illustrations by Emily Hughes, and of course, published by Chronicle Books 
of San Francisco. Thank you so much for joining in. I hope you enjoyed that one. It is a beautiful one. It is a funny one. Always makes me laugh. And I hope that you do have a magical day today. I hope you do have a wonderful day indeed. Thank you so much for being here with us. And as always, um, please let us know where you're joining in from and who is joining in with you. And indeed, send us, send us a greeting, send us your love, and we'll do just the same. Thank you so much for joining in. Erin and Clara, I hope that you enjoyed that one indeed out there in mild and I'm sure magical Massachusetts. Thank you so much for being here with us. And of course, Tara, good morning to you as well. Thank you for being here with us. Amanda West, thank you for joining in. Sarah and Nathan, thank you for joining in out there in very, very windy Illinois. And of course, uh, very magical too. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Have a wonderful day. Thank you for being here on Storytime. And remember too that Jack the Library Cat is coming to Storytime. I'm excited for them to be here. Marietta and Jack will be here on March 2nd. And of course, um, thank you. Thank you for being here. Please do check out all these books that we read here on Storytime at your local library and get to see if you can uh, finish up reading um, some of the bits that we've left out. For example, in this one today, we read two stories. There's still two amazing adventures that you can catch up on in this one. So find it at your local library and get to enjoy it. Thank you so much for being here, friends. Absolutely appreciate you. I hope that you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Yes, it's our story today. Charlie and Mouse definitely brought the magic. They have us laughing, and I hope that this laughter continues into the day. You know the best laughter is when your heart laughs. Maybe you might not even be laughing out loud, but your heart is so glad because we're just um, feeling good. And I hope that for everyone that is here today, and of course, for everybody else out there in the world too. Yes, indeed. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime. Appreciations to all of you. Hugs, hugs, hugs. And I'll see you again tomorrow. Yes, inshallah, i see you again tomorrow for more Storytime when we're back with another exciting book from Claudia Rueda. And this time, Bunny is not overboard, but this time, Bunny is hungry. Yes, Hungry Bunny coming to us from Claudia Rueda. Get ready for this one. Join in the fun. Thank you so much for being here with us on Storytime, everybody. Much love from me. I will see you again tomorrow for more Storytime. Ah, bye-bye. <laughs>